Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. This customer's concern was that their truck feels weird while driving. The mechanic noticed the driver's side rear tire was bubbled, and a couple of minutes later, this happened. There it goes. Go. Told you. Damn. Told you. <laughs> Told you. There it goes. And this customer had one of the tires blow out while driving on the highway. The mechanic also found the three other tires to have 90 PSI in them. Customer states they replaced their alternator but still not charging the battery. This vehicle has a manual belt tensioner and the customer never tightened the belt after replacing the alternator. The mechanic tightened the belt and it fixed the customer's concern. All that needed was a little bit of belt tension. And this customer came in because they keep hearing a noise when turning right. This customer's complaint is that their whole car is shaken, but apparently only when they turn on the AC. And this customer's concern is that their car is all over the road. This vehicle came in for a service and the technician noticed the customer used flashlights as fog lights and actually had them wired to a switch. This customer spilled 20 liters of gravy in their brand new Land Rover when they were on their way to a dinner event. Customer states, I hit something in the road. Hmm, don't look too bad. Let's check the wheel. Okay, I think you did hit something. This garbage truck came in for a service and the mechanic realized this wheel was ready to fall off. So coming into work this morning, looking inside the drum of this Mack truck. This is Grayson, everybody. Say hi. Aww. Customer states front windshield washer is not working. Washer fluid was empty, filled up fluid, washer jets now operable. And here's a clip of the rear shocks I just removed from my 1991 F-150. Hopefully this is a good reminder not to overfill your tires. If you've enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like or subscribing, and you can submit your clips at justrolledinyt.com. Thanks for watching.